Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's episode, I'm going to show you how we can create a force field effect using the Unity particle system. So let's get started. Start by creating a new particle system and rename it to force field underscore mat. Okay, now inside uh, render, set its max particle size to three. And after that, set the emission to zero and add a burst of two. Okay, then we need a texture. I have this one downloaded from Google. I'm going to put it into my textures folder and this is how it looks and okay now we will create a new material and we will rename it to force force field underscore additive underscore mat okay and now i'm going to change its shader to legacy shaders particles and additive and drag and drop this texture here now drag and drop this material here looks good okay so after that inside render select this one to mesh and a sphere okay great now render alignment will stay at view set the start lifetime to random between two constants and the values will be four and six set the start speed to zero now restart it and this is how it looks next is start size set it to 10 we start it and okay now we have 3d start rotation set random between two constants and the values will stay between 0 and 360 so put it to 360 360 and 360 and set its alpha to 35 okay after that uncheck shape so that it should emit from a same point and then we have color over lifetime here what we have to do is we have to add some keyframes one two three four and five keyframes set this one to zero then this one to zero again this one to zero and zero okay half for work is done last thing is rotation over lifetime and set it to random between no, no don't set it to random between two constants separate axis and set the values to 20 20 and 20. I think inside emission add a burst of 3 and increase the lifetime to 4 and 6 so that we have much more diversity and restart it. Now we have more of these and this one to 3. Now this one looks good and much more like a force field effect. Let's reduce the opacity to 20 so that we have much more transparency. And uh, that's it. Let's see how it looks in the game view bring the camera a little bit near and uh, think I think I should increase the opacity because inside game view it looks fine and yeah so that's it this is how we create a force field effect in the unity particle system uh, I hope you enjoyed the tutorial make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos we will see you in a new video. Goodbye.